like, oh. We really are a match made in heaven. I'm so excited if you can't tell. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hi, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Taryn and in this video, I am going to be unboxing, really exciting, town pouch from YSL and a Gucci belt which matches. I'm really excited. I got them both from Flannel earlier today. Um, so they're from the store, but I'm going, this is the first time I brought them home and actually I'm going to have a look at them. So I'm really, really excited. <sighs> Let's just jump into this, shall we? <laughs> I can't wait any longer. Right, so I'm just ripping open the seal. So subscribe because once I reach a thousand subscribers, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. It's going to be a luxury one. I'm not going to say just yet. But if you're subscribed, you'll be entered into the draw once I reach a thousand. So I'm really excited to do that and just show some appreciation back to you guys. It's like a give and get situation now. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the Saint Laurent box. <laughs> so I'm just opening it up. Do on camera so you can see. So now I have dust bag oh it's all so exciting when you get new things dust bag is really nice obviously oh my gosh i love this i love it i just thought it would literally go with everything and it just feels luxurious and obviously it is it's wire <laughs> wow well, it's a magnet close it has this like I don't know, foam to protect it, I suppose. And um, wow. Well. <laughs> I love this so much. As soon as I saw it, I just thought it's so classy, so elegant, so easy to wear day to night. I just, oh, it's gorgeous. I love the colour. It's just, I mean. And what I love about the YSL bags, the logo is kind of like an accessory. It just looks so. Uh, like it just it looks great it's like a soft grain leather this is inside so you can easily fit a phone and like a card holder in there it's kind of like this lined black material i don't know if the camera is picking it up it's like a lined um cotton so it's quite nice and it doesn't have any compartments or anything like that so if you're someone who likes compartments i wouldn't recommend this at all but for me, I'm a very on-the-go, messy girl, won't lie. I'll just shove my phone in there along with some cards. But perhaps if I'm feeling organised, I'll put a card holder in there. Rare. <laughs> if you're just popping out for like a little bit and you don't really want like a bag on you as such, I just think it's perfect. And it's £410 or something like that. I think, you know, for a YSL bag, which is a pretty good price. I think it's going to wear quite a bit if you don't look after it, definitely. It's not too bad when you open it up. Sometimes like bags have this weird thing here. This isn't too bad. I definitely think this is going to wear quite quickly. When I say quite quickly, by the way, I mean it's still going to last you years. But I think when you want to resell it, it is going to look a little damaged. I don't think it's a good investment piece. So to really keep your money where it is, this I think is just going to depreciate. So it's really not an investment piece. The Gucci belt, however, is an investment piece. So, so I got the matching Gucci belt. So let me tell you a little story as I get it why I got these. So I'm going away on a staycation because, you know, it's too risky to go away right now. Is there anyone else going away? I just didn't want to risk it. Um, it's just so expensive. Like the prices are through the roof. And also you have to self-isolate or you might have to self-isolate. Also, you don't even know if you can go. Like, the greenness is just changing all of the time. Me and my friend, we are staying in a cottage with a hot tub. It's all so exciting. I'm so excited. We both are. And um, we planned a few things for the weekend. So we planned an afternoon tea. Um, we're going out for dinner every night. We're away for three nights in total, four nights. Um, so it's just really exciting. And I was putting outfits together, and I was like... I am really missing like something here. I'm missing, you know, like I have some designer bags, but I don't really have anything which could be like casual 
and like evening and I just feel like this bag can be casual or evening. I'm gonna stand up and show it with this outfit actually quickly before I show you the belt. So do you know what I mean? So right now I just have some casual trousers on and a jumper and I just think like it just elevates it. So cute! <laughs> oh my gosh I love it. I love it. So I just undid it. By the way how cute is this little less bag? So Gucci, look at that print. It's so cute. I, th I love details. Like, this is why I love getting. Sorry, let me just sort my fringe out. Does anyone else do this with a full fringe? If it doesn't go, you just split it. I do it. I just, I love little details. I That's why I love high end things. So, this belt is a little white Gucci belt. It has the GG, of course. As you can see. What I love about luxury logos, like um, embellishments on accessories, is that it's so thick and you can just tell the quality. The quality to me is all I preach about on this channel is quality. Um, with cheap things, with expensive things, quality is just a must. And what I love about luxury is that the quality is just extra good, so it just makes me ooh, so happy. <laughs> this belt is like this white colour, it's like an off-white. It's exactly the same colour as the bag. I think the exact colour what this is called is cream and gold, but to me it's like a cool cream, it's not like a yellowy cream. They match perfectly. The shop assistant did help me with these and she did say that they are exactly the same tone. I splurged on a designer belt ever and I just thought, do you know what? Designer belts go with absolutely everything. They're like 200 odd pounds and they make every single... Sorry, there was just a lorry going through a puddle. <laughs> they make every single outfit look as if it's all like designer, Gucci, you know? Like it puts the... The designer print on it and I just feel like a designer accessory which goes with everything is just an absolute mess. So you just plop it in there and it always looks clean. That's what I love about a designer belt, like they always look so clean. With um, high street belts I just find they never have that seamless look. Do you know what I'm saying? Like do you know what I'm saying? Um, I've always bought belts before from like River Island or you know just those like buckle belts and I just find like they don't look seamless like they just look a bit bulky or like you know what I mean like a bit overlapping or just like doesn't fall right I just feel like the attention to detail with more expensive things is so there and you just it just makes you look so seamless like all the time D does that I mean obviously this isn't on properly so I really like the way it comes out a little bit as well. Some people might not like that and it might be a bit like off-putting but I kind of like it because it kind of makes the logo stand out more. Just something to bear in mind. Another thing which I love about this as well, just again another attention to detail, like it's quite hard to pop it off so you just know it's not like flimsy, it's not gonna fall off on you for entire, no entire reason. Um, I just thought I would show you guys exactly you know, what you would be buying if you were to buy these items because I find a lot of unboxing and like first impressions and things, they just kind of show you and they go, oh, here you go. I always like to give that extra because I know what I would want from a video. Like, oh, oh my gosh. I'm so excited if you can't tell. <laughs> I can't. Okay. Okay, I'm done. I'm done just being obsessed with these um, things. Yeah. Okay. I really, <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this video. I've definitely, definitely enjoyed buying these things, looking at these things, feeling these things, as weird as that sounds. <laughs> I've really, oh so obsessed okay as I said I will I'm back and I'm gonna be doing a video a week I will aim for otherwise it's gonna be a video every two weeks so 